Cunningham back to throw it. He's going to take off. Cunningham is down at about the one-yard line. After he had to come out of the pocket. Then the Eagles only have one one timeout left. They're going to get the two-minute right right now, though. And two minutes to go. The Eagles are at the Cowboy one. And it's 24-13 Dallas. Back at Texas Stadium, two minutes left. Dallas 24-13. Pat Summerall with John Madden. The Eagles have it first and goal at the one. Now they're in a situation, John, so where if they score, they have to go for two points. They have to go for two, and then if they had their timeouts left, they could probably kick the ball deep, but they only have one timeout left, so I think they'd probably have to go for an onside kick. They've tried one successfully to start this drive. That's Garner, and he didn't get in. Here's a big play by Robert Jones. Because, again, the Eagles only have one timeout left. Watch Jones. He's going to come, and he's going to hit that thing. He reads it, comes right around the pile, gets his shoulder square. Oh, that's a good tackle. That is a great tackle. Yeah. I'm surprised that the Eagles don't throw down here because with no timeouts left, at least with an incomplete pass, that stops the clock. Cunningham gets to Garner, and he's thrown backwards for a loss. Now I'm really Robert Jones again. Now they got to take their time out. And now they don't get out. a second guess, but they should have thrown both of those balls. I mean, it's just the thing because if he hits that play again, then you have to use your time out. You see, and, and the and the Cowboys for some reason are playing run down here. And you think a play pass, you, you could get something in the end zone. Robert Jones with two key plays to knock the Eagles backwards. 24-13, Cowboys lead. 121 left in the fourth. The Eagles out of timeout. Texas Stadium and Eza has had a busy afternoon. And they're not leaving. Charles Haley had a big busy afternoon himself. Those of you who watched the Rams and the Giants, welcome to Texas Stadium. Pat Summerall here with John Madden. The Cowboys lead the Philadelphia Eagles 24-13. That's the final. Rams have beaten the Giants. It's third down and goal for uh, the Eagles on the seven. They're out of timeout. Yeah, the Eagles foul that up because when you're on the one-yard line, that's a running down, but not when you only have one timeout, you need two scores. Then it becomes a passing down. Now this is a passing down. Flag on the play. And the Eagles are going backwards fast. Tom McHale moved. Ball start, third the snap, 68 offense, five yards to keep third down. They were at about the half yard line, now they're back. Now you can see he's ready to pass protect. He's back there. Now once you get set, you can't move at all. And just that little move there. He's in there for Broderick Thompson. Jeff Coat got him with that little flinch. Made him move. Jeff Coat had gotten Bernard Williams on that other side, too. Third and goal at the 12. 121 left to play. Cunningham. Has to duck under and does duck under. Pass, I believe, is intercepted in the end zone. Larry Brown came up with the interception in the end zone. And that should do it. The Eagles are out of timeout. Now that Cowboy defense has played great all day, and those two corners have been superb. Cowboys will take over. They lead 24-13. Well, you're just going to see Larry Brown out here. You just they, they they spread the defense out, spread the offense out, try and get everyone off. Brown started up like tight coverage, then he just backs off, and then when Cunningham starts to scramble, he stays underneath. He's staying between the receiver and Cunningham, and Randall Cunningham just threw it right to Larry Brown who had good position. There was nothing there for Cunningham to throw to. Larry Brown still got the ball. And he's 
going to keep that ball. I, you know, we were, again, talking about how, how well those Cowboy corners and whole secondary. But well, the whole defense is playing the number one in the league. What the heck? Miller Light, player of the game, is Troy Aikman. He took another beating. Confused, perhaps, a little bit by the Eagle defense and the coverage in the beginning, but bounced back. Uh, he really hung that last touchdown pass that he threw to Novacek. That was a thing of beauty. And, you know, as you say, he started off slowly. Things weren't working for him, but he made things happen. They'll just run this one out. The Eagles can't do anything but shake hands now. We've seen them the last couple of weeks. Yep. They're the best team in the NFL. Charles Haley, one of the great contributors today and every week. Bill Bates, Lincoln Coleman, William Fuller. Bill Romanowski. Randall Cunningham, a frustrating day. The final score here at Texas Stadium is Dallas 24, Philadelphia 13. Coming up, it's the NASDAQ stock market postgame report. James and Terry will get you up to date on all of today's NFL action with scores and highlights from around the NFL. That's all coming up next on the NASDAQ stock market postgame report.